With each passing day, drone technology seems to be getting better, smarter and more sophisticated in a groundbreaking feat. China has once again emerged as a trailblazer with its groundbreaking drone developments, most notably the introduction of a first-of-its-kind drone weapon. This technological marvel represents a significant leap forward in China's prowess, showcasing not only its commitment to innovation, but also its strategic vision in reshaping the dynamics of modern warfare. One thing is now crystal clear. China's drone power is now completely unmatched. Today's episode will cover China's first-of-a-kind, drone weapon and how China utilizes its drone power to the fullest. This technological leap, detailed in a peer-reviewed article published in the High Power Laser and Particle Beams Journal, has the potential to reshape the global military landscape significantly. At the PLA Strategic Support Force Information Engineering University, this breakthrough involves a compact yet powerful microwave source designed to be seamlessly integrated into various drone models. Now, imagine a swarm of drones equipped with this cutting-edge microwave technology, not merely disrupting, but potentially altering the balance of military power permanently. The versatility of this microwave source is a game-changer. As highlighted by the research team, it transcends the limitations of conventional small microwave sources operating over an ultra-wide frequency range and rivaling larger weapons like professional electronic warfare aircraft. But here's the intriguing twist. This isn't just about jamming signals. The drone-mounted microwave source is presented as a multifunctional marvel. It serves not only as a radar, but also as a tool for target monitoring on various terrains, including the ground, water, and sky, all while executing electronic jamming. Picture the scope of possibilities. Imagine the drone acting as both a watchful eye and a disruptor in diverse military scenarios. Now, let's delve into the science behind this innovation. At the core of this weapon lies a device known as the traveling wave tube, traditionally a microwave generator. However, Chinese scientists have ingeniously repurposed it into a supersensitive antenna, eliminating the need for a separate radar on the drone. This fusion of functions within a small package is nothing short of a technological milestone, overcoming challenges that arise when different components operate simultaneously. As we ponder the implications, consider the strategic advantage this technology offers. China, already a major player in drone production, is strategically leveraging its advancements in unmanned aircraft technology to initiate a potential arms race. The affordability and capability of Chinese military drones equipped with these powerful microwave weapons could tip the scales in regions of geopolitical contention, such as the South China Sea and Taiwan. A long-range Chinese combat drone capable of carrying a large weapons payload has circled Taiwan. The prospect of disrupting or deceiving enemy radars with these weaponized drones enhances China's defense capabilities in contested maritime territories. Now, let's raise a question. How might this newfound technological prowess influence global electronic warfare dynamics? The researchers hint at a broader vision, the integration of microwave weapons into hypersonic aircraft and other near-space platforms. This suggests a concerted effort by the Chinese military and industries to extend the application of these advanced technologies beyond drones. How might this expansion impact electronic warfare strategies on a global scale? The collaboration between the Chinese military and industries further amplifies the significance of this development. It signals a dedicated effort to deploy these advanced technologies on an expanding drone fleet, marking a significant stride in China's pursuit of dominance in the realm of electronic warfare. What could be the potential ripple effects of such collaboration on the geopolitical stage? As we navigate this evolving landscape, the fusion of military prowess and technological innovation unveils a compelling narrative of strategy and competition in the modern era. China's assertive foray into drone warfare marks a decade-long journey of intensive research and development, showcasing a level of confidence that sets it apart from other militaries globally. The People's Liberation Army, PLA, particularly its Air Force and Navy, views drones not merely as auxiliaries, but as crucial combat components, compensating for perceived weaknesses and contributing to a robust asymmetric strategy. 
In contrast to the more selective use of drones by the United States in specific operations, the PLA integrates them comprehensively into its military operations. This approach reflects a strategic perspective that sees drones as integral offensive combat systems, equal in importance to modern combat carriers like the J-20 stealth fighter and nuclear-armed submarines. To offset potential deficiencies in its modern combat carriers, China adopts an asymmetric strategy, combining thousands of missiles positioned near the Taiwan coast with drone technology. This synergy, when coupled with modern fighter jets, submarines, and surface ships operating closer to China's coast, poses a formidable challenge to American forces. The PLA's ambition extends to the development of a twin-seat version of the J-20, capable of operating multiple air drones, creating a protective barrier, and enhancing its capabilities against superior American fighters. Picture this scenario, a flying aircraft carrier, a mothership air drone carrying several drones for swarm attacks against enemy aircraft and air defense systems. The GJ-11 Stealth Air Drone, showcased at Airshow China 2021, exemplifies China's prowess in developing advanced reconnaissance and attack drones, surpassing anything currently in the United States inventory. Notably, the Chinese Air Force doesn't limit itself to cutting-edge drones. It repurposes obsolete fighter jets like the J-7 into drones, using them to potentially confuse opponents when deployed in tandem with modern fighters. This adaptive approach, though not individually matching Taiwan's modern fighters, poses a challenge when used strategically in large numbers. The PLA Navy PLAN, anticipating increased tensions and emphasizing naval warfare, mirrors the U.S. Navy's belief in the importance of drones in future conflicts. China's development of a cross-medium UAV, capable of operating both underwater and in the air, along with drone ships carrying smaller water drones for surface attacks, showcases the extent of its investments in maritime drone capabilities. Yunzhou Tech's drone ship, equipped with six smaller water drones operating in coordination, reflects the growing sophistication of Chinese technology. These developments suggest a trajectory where ship drones become more powerful, potentially carrying greater numbers of smaller attack drones. The innovation doesn't stop there. Chinese scientists have designed a shark-shaped drone for submarine attacks, emphasizing the expanding scope and versatility of drone applications. One cannot overlook the significant strides China has made in hypersonic technology, with media reports suggesting the successful landing of a hypersonic drone. If accurate, this achievement propels China ahead of the United States in both drone and hypersonic capabilities, signaling a potential shift in the balance of power. In the context of a hypothetical conflict over Taiwan, the PLAN doesn't envision engaging the U.S. Navy in a conventional naval battle. Instead, it relies on proximity to its logistic base and the protective cover of its missile umbrella near China's coast. This strategic advantage complicates U.S. efforts to reach Taiwan, turning such an operation into a challenging and potentially costly endeavor. While the U.S. military remains slightly ahead in various areas, including aircraft carriers, stealth fighters, nuclear-armed submarines, the evolving landscape raises questions. If China were to secure a lead in critical areas such as hypersonic missiles, stealth attack drones, and cyber warfare, the balance of power might shift completely. The PLA's conviction that drones represent the future of modern warfare serves as a warning for the United States to invest more significantly in drone technology and its countermeasures. What's clear is that the PLA believes that drones are the future of modern warfare, which is why it has embraced it. With much about China's first-of-a-kind drone weapon and how China utilizes its drone power to the fullest covered, it is time to wrap this one up. If you have any topics in mind, comment below and we will cover them for you. As always, subscribe to never miss out. This is Race to Space and we will see you in the next one.